Hi guys, Marilla Steele here from Fashion Steel NYC and welcome back to my channel. Do not forget to like and subscribe to never miss a video. So we are here in my closet, and I get so many questions about my closet, y'all. If you're interested in any details, check out my home decor section. I have an entire video all about my closet, how much it costs, how I got it built, everything you need to know there's also a link to it below in the description so today we are here because i'm going to be showing you guys how to style black and white looks for summer i know i have a lot of black pieces i have a lot of white pieces it's a really cool way to elevate a look you look super chic when you're wearing only black and white it's a really cool way to get the most mileage out of your clothes so without further ado let's just get right into it so first up, I'm wearing one of my favorite little razor tees that I got from Zara. I'm not sure if they have them anymore, but I will be sure to link a few of the similar ones below. I'm also wearing my fave biker short. Y'all, so these biker shorts are only $5 from Boohoo. So get them in every color. They are amazing. These are actually the long cycling shorts. And then I paired that with this linen black and white striped jacket from Zara. Y'all, this jacket is so old. I've had it for like five years. For real, for real, five years. So I'm gonna pair this outfit with these chic sandals that are also from Misguided. I love these, like, they're too good. And that creates the whole look. Another way to rock your biker shorts, if they're black, is with a really long kind of like silky black top. This one I have is actually vintage. I got so many questions about this top when I posted it on my Instagram, but alas, it is vintage. But Boohoo actually has a similar one. I think they also have a similar one at Misguided. So I will post the link to that below in the description. The back is not open, but essentially it's the same shirt. But yeah, love this look. I want to definitely pair this with a white shoe to keep with our white theme. My white Alexander Wang heels. These heels are so good. Get into them. Also going to add this stowed or stod bag that I love so much. It's actually on sale on I think Net-A-Porter and Shopbop. So I'll put a link to that below. But yes. It's a look. So next up is this look with some culottes that I thrifted um, a few videos ago. They are from Atelier. I paired them with these Proenzer Schuler heels and this Urban Outfitters top. I love this top. I like bought it in like every color so if you're interested in this this is available these are not a lot of the things that i show in my videos are old like people get on me they're like oh my god who are those shoes by and then i tell them and they're like i can't find them girl i had these shoes for five years that's why so be sure to check down below in the description if i can find it for you i will link it for sure but these shoes add any pizzazz to an outfit i love them and they're just perfect. Let's get into the next look. This one will include a pair of my favorite vintage Levi jeans. Gotta have a great pair of Levi's, guys. So these are my favorite vintage Levi jeans. They fit amazing. If I can, I will find a few pair for you guys online and link them below. I'm pairing it with my favorite linen shirt from H&M. You guys, I wear this top to death. I wear it at least two times a week. I'm actually gonna buy another one because I feel like I've run this one into the ground. What I like to do for the summer months is just tie it like that. Kind of tuck it in. Or tuck it up like so 
and rock it just like that. It looks so great with like a gold medallion necklace. This is one of my favorite necklaces. It's from Brinker and Eliza. I'll be sure to link them below, but amazing jewelry. How cute though. For the shoes, I'm going to go with my favorite Chanel mules with the pearl heel. These are super chic and easy to walk in. Love them. And they kind of just pull the whole look together. Not go wrong with a good pair of sunglasses. Y'all remember these? I got these for for like five or six dollars. So good, right? Next up, I have on another one of those tank tops from Urban Outfitters. There's a link below. Yes, I have it in black and white and a bunch of other colors. They're that good. And this time, I paired it with a black satin skirt. Satin skirts are so in. It hits me right above the ankle. It's actually from Lafayette 148 and it's kind of old, but there are tons of skirt like this online and I've linked a bunch of them below. And what I'm going to do is pair them with my fave sandals from Zara at the moment. They are so good and chic. They go with just about anything. If you haven't caught yours from Zara, you're playing yourself. Let's get into this look. super chic and then I'm going to pair it with my new favorite bangle from mango I will put a link to this bangle below like how cool is that I can also mix and match it with this dinosaur bangle that I got from shop Bob it makes the perfect arm candy it's a look Last but not least is this Something by Sanji Address. She makes amazing clothing, by the way. Support black business. I'll put a link to her below. I love this dress because of this crinkle pattern. I think it's so good. I actually wore this dress during New York Fashion Week and I layered it. I think that it is a great layering piece. It's so cute. I could definitely wear it alone or I can layer it. Let me show you how I would wear it alone and how I would layer it. So if I'm just gonna wear it alone, I can pair it with these really cool Jeffrey Campbell sandals that have the tiniest heels so I can still get around walking around town. And it just creates this super chic look that I love. Of course, I can wear it with my doe purse, which I wear a lot. The white color is just perfect for summer. You can really wear it with anything. Very chic. Then I could also layer it with this skirt. This is a white denim skirt that I got from Uniqlo. I'm not sure if they still have it. If they do, I'll put it below. If not, I'll put a few similar ones. I know they have similar ones at Gap. It has a cool little slit here. So let me layer it for you. I love this skirt. It fits like a dream. So I can either this which is actually what I did during New York Fashion Week, except I had a yellow skirt underneath. It's really cute. Or I can actually wear it as a shirt. All right, guys, so this is how it looks. If I tuck it in, still a super chic look that I love. Because it's so chic, I would pair it with something kind of neutral like these black tippy fringe slides that I wear so much. They are super comfortable. My favorite <laughs> summer slides for the moment. And there you have it. All right guys, thanks so much for checking out the six ways to style black and white outfit of the days for summer. It's super chic, definitely try it out. See what you have in your wardrobe and create a few of these looks. All of the links to these products can be found below if they're still available and I can find them. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and stay tuned for some more of these style videos. I think I'm gonna do more. I already do them a ton on my Instagram, so why not just do a few here too? Let me know if you'd like to see more and if you have any suggestions, 
for videos, definitely drop them below. All right, guys. Bye.